In this video, I'd like to talk to you about the difference between the opacity and the fill inside of Photoshop. If you've noticed in your layers panel, you've got two different ways, which can sometimes seem very similar in order to make an object transparent, and that's the opacity, and below there's the fill. And if, you, if I, I've got here a rectangle, it's just a normal rectangle standing on its own on a regular layer above this white background. And if I drop the opacity, you'll notice it it's get lighter. It's gonna be more and more transparent against the white. It's gonna more white's gonna show through. But if I decrease the fill, it'll seem like the very same thing is happening. And here it doesn't seem like much of a difference whichever one you use. But let's see here, because I've got an example where it does matter. So if I hide this and I show this circle here, and this circle has a couple of blending modes on them. On it, I should say. It's got a drop shadow, and it's got a stroke. And this is where you'll notice the difference. So if I decrease the opacity here, you'll notice that before, as before, the entire thing is gonna get transparent. Everything on the layer is getting transparent, including the blending options, which is layer style. But if I drag down the fill instead, we're going to see that just the fill color will get transparent. The overall layer style is going to stay the same until you either adjust the opacity afterwards to fade that down too, or go ahead and fade down using the opacity in the individual layer styles. If you go ahead and fade that down, you will get more control over what you're going to fade. So you have the ability to fade the overall opacity or just the fill color. So you can create these gaps and holes here, which will be more visible if I turn on this um, rectangle of before. You'll see that it is indeed transparent in the middle, but not around the edges there. And if I bring just a tad back, you de you're going to see what's going to happen here. So that's the small difference between opacity and fill, but it's a very, very big difference that makes for differences when you're designing.